Humans and machines have been working together since, really since people first climbed out of trees and started banging rocks together. What we're now seeing in the digital age is an interaction between humans and digital online machines that are giving them the same opportunities to develop and change society. Humane is a project that was started to understand the ways in which humans and machines interact, how human-machine networks operate, what are the key features of those networks, and what are the relationships that occur within it. In Humane Projects, we wanted to take a theoretical approach and come up with a framework in which we could understand how these collaborative systems work. The goal of Humane was to address this challenge of analyzing and designing for human-machine networks. Hence, from the outset, we start stated the overall objective of Humane as to improve public and private services by uncovering how new human-machine networks can change patterns of interaction, behavior, trust and sociability. To obtain this, we set out to develop a framework for analyzing human-machine networks, the Humane Typology and a method to apply this framework to support analysis and design for human-machine networks. So before we started the Humane project, there was no existing typology or classification of what we call a human-machine network. During the first year of the Humane project, we realized that to make the Humane typology a method more easily applicable, and also to share some of the analysis work we have done in the Humane case studies, we ought to develop an online tool for profiling of human-machine networks. The tool provides a low threshold means to analyzing a human machine network in terms of the humane typology dimensions. The analytical framework that we have developed in the Humane project not only allows us to understand the cases that we directly study in the project, but also it allows us to consider similar cases and even the human machine networks that are not yet developed and compare them to the existing examples through the profiling tool that we have developed. Um, so as part of the validation and the evaluation of what we were doing in Humane, uh, we took specifically the profile uh, of the human machine network uh, and sat down with the people involved in the Evacuate project itself. We were particularly interested to understand if they could see any benefit out of representing the network through um, a set, a complex relationship of different dimensions. In the final phase of the project, we produced three roadmaps for three domains sharing the economy, e health, and citizen participation. The roadmaps are an important outcome of the whole project. We hope that they will help to increase awareness and help to better design human machine networks in the future. Knowledge about human machine networks is important as ever more of our social and working lives, as well as industrial value creation, happens in such networks. Such knowledge is important for industry, for the public sector, and also for political policymaking. Our ambition for the Humane Project is for it to have served as a step towards this needed knowledge of human-machine networks. <laughs>